So do do any to do anything with the Cypress, right? So you need to do the Node.js installation. Link is there, right? And of course, you write the code on your computer is fine, but that's not the goal. Code you have to push to the remote, which is the Git. You can download the Git from this link. But the writing the code, remember VS Code. So you need to write the you need to download the VS Code, install it, then you can write the code. That's the link. Now you need to do the Cypress as the core tool for the writing, running, debugging your automated testing tools. So you need to download this as well. Good. Now you go to the Faker API testing, generate realistic test data, which is very powerful. It is interview question, right? Um, any application you do, right? Application, you need to create many, many, many test data. Some of the application is um, you need to create the real test data. Otherwise, the application is not going to work, right? If you do the SSN testing, you need to use the, the test SSN. You cannot just create the fake SSN, right? If you test the, um, the, uh, the whatever it's called, uh, the credit card testing, you cannot use the fake, the credit card. So wherever you, you just have to use the test credit card, wherever you are, you are able to pass uh, the many, many test data, they, they do not have to be reliable. They can be just using anything. Fake RGS, it is the JavaScript based the package you can use to actually pass the dynamic data. You need to use this. For the file upload, you need to use this library as well. So you need to download it. And Cypress, the Mocha, oh, Mocha was some reporter. So that's for the reporting. Of course, you write the code and you, you create, you generate the test data. Finally, you have to generate the report so you can see. So you have to use it for this reporting. This is exactly, we are going to do the environment setup. Now you're ready to go. Go next. <clears throat> 